It was 10 years ago today that domestic terrorism came to Arizona. Despite an unprecedented investigation, we still do not know who was responsible for the wreck of the Sunset Limited. I was asleep, and all of a sudden there was a this thing just 68 people aboard the Amtrak train when it derailed near the desert community of Hyder. One person was killed. Rescue crews eventually reached the site, but their efforts to save lives at what appeared to be an accident inadvertently hampered the subsequent criminal investigation. Helicopters arrive, they land, they, they get there to help the injured, and what happens to all the evidence on the ground? Those helicopters spin it all up into the air. Annie Montgomery is the author of The Jerusalem Syndrome, a historical novel based on the Sunset Limited wreck. Investigators determined the derailment was no accident when they saw the tracks had been sabotaged and found several notes from a group calling itself the Sons of the Gestapo, claiming responsibility for the attack. With all the resources put into the probe dubbed Operation Split Rail, officials were confident an arrest was imminent. I really believe uh, in the justice system and I think these people will be caught and, uh, and justice will be done. Crews cleared away the wreckage and today Amtrak no longer serves Phoenix. A decade later, there still has not been an arrest. Unless somebody comes forward who knew about it, I think that's the only way they will. If someone confesses or someone says, look, you know, my dad on his deathbed said he did it. Um, I, I think it'll be very difficult to solve. A $320,000 reward is still being offered for information leading those responsible for the sabotage of the Sunset Limited. The FBI telephone number is 602-279-5511.